It's got really bad stickers through some of it yeah. to stay clear. Uh, well, they, the they grow like a little weed. Oh, here it is. There's two, um, two sprays right here. And we walk through it, so it's kind of... Yeah, well, that's clearly brush. What is this? Two brush. We don't know. It looks like some kind of fish thing. The, the smell was over here. The smell it was, was up, up off this point. point. I'm not sure. They the found, dogs were interested here. They found the dog in a bag over here. I get a wetsuit, just walk it real quick. If it gets deep, then we'll go to August. Yo. No, I'm good, I'm good. Houston. Houston, law enforcement? Yeah. All right. All right, that other one's good to go. Ron, you ain't in there. We're trying to clear the most likely areas, and uh, we're going to be employing a parallel line search that'll be tended from the surface. And that's that's our plan for right now. But we're we're obviously looking for uh, targets where we think they're most likely. We got some phone calls. I'm in a harness. Yeah. The divers are saying that based upon the wind, the, okay. the mark could be as far out as those rocks. Okay. They they, they got a mark. They have an entrance mark in this area. Okay. So they're saying it could be potentially could be as far out as those rocks. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Alright. my foot right here. Alright, it does not move. Hold on, he's getting What does it look like down there? Oh, it's, it's, it's black water. You can't really see a whole lot. To avoid any kind of confusion that you would have in doing a, a, a search in black water with somebody you've never uh, dove with before, we put these three guys together because they've worked together. So we don't have to relearn things that you have to learn diving with new people. So it's more effective, more efficient, and you have better execution. Our search area. Right. It's very effective. The military uses it. I'm going to get a shot of you, Ron. Yeah. 